This is his uh, job site. They're going to build a 28-story condo hotel here. And it's right on A1A facing the ocean. And uh, there's our address. What we're going to do is between 20 and 30,000 square feet of this spoil pile. They're going to use it for other purposes here on the construction site, but right now they're having a big problem with the residents keeping dust down. The residents being the people of this building. They've already filed lawsuits against them for dust, and in 2008 this is going to become a, a city enforcement matter throughout the USA. Uh, this year it's just the EPA. Well, here's the first spray. He's using a fogging tip. And this is the first application. There's going to be two more after this. This is done at an 8 to 1 dilution rate. We want it to soak in well into this sand because it has to stay here for over a year. This is an example of LDC with our new wetting agent in action. It's soaking right into this sand immediately and uh, getting a good foothold on this slope. It's got a good, what would you say, Joel, three to one, two to one slope here? It's about a two to one slope, I guess. On better calculation, it's a one to one slope. About a 45 degree angle here. And this could be a tough one to maintain, so he's really going to have to soak these slopes or we'll have mass erosion in here. Well, there's our spray rig up close and personal. And he's used about 150 gallons just on this one slope alone. And he's working his way around. We have on this particular dust control agent, we put in our 2001 additive, which reduces the UV uh, from penetrating and breaking up the soil the soil dust control. This is a very fine powdery sand that was excavated out of the site for building a 28-story building. We've got about 20, as I said, 20 to 25,000 square feet of it. We really have two problems here because you not only have heavy sun most of the summer season, but also 20 to 25 mile an hour winds most of the time because it's an onshore breeze right off the Gulf of Mexico down here. You might be able to hear the wind blowing here in the microphone. 